Meet Pibot, Korea's LLL, M-powered smart robotic pilots. In South Korea, a new generation of smart LLM-powered robotic pilots is being developed to take over the flying duties of human pilots. The first of these pilots, dubbed Pibot, has already been put to the test in several actual flight situations. The development of Pibot is part of a larger trend of increasing automation in the aviation industry. Air travel is becoming increasingly safe and the use of robots and artificial intelligence is seen as a way to further reduce accidents and improve efficiency. In addition to Pibot, there are other examples of aviation automation, such as the use of drones for air traffic control and the development of autonomous airplanes. Pilot training is a critical component of aviation safety. The use of robots like Pibot has the potential to improve pilot training by providing a more realistic environment for learning. In the future, Pibot could also be used to provide advanced assistance to pilots during flights, such as helping to avoid bad weather or providing real-time information about the status of the aircraft. Pibot is a smart robotic pilot designed to provide safe and efficient air transportation. The robot is equipped with an LLLM low-level maneuvering system that allows it to avoid obstacles and land safely. Pibot has been tested in various scenarios, including emergency landings, and has completed all tests. The sensors allow Pibot to identify and track aircraft, as well as other objects in its vicinity. The artificial intelligence enables Pibot to make decisions on its own, without the need for a human operator. This makes Pibot the perfect pilot for any situation, whether it be takeoff, landing, or flying in formation. David Sheem, an associate professor of electrical engineering at KIST, told Euronews Next. According to the KAIST team, Pibot also has a large memory that enables it to memorize all the Jeppesen aeronautical navigation charts worldwide, a feat that human pilots cannot achieve. Humans can fly many aeroplanes, but they do have these habits built into them. So when they try to convert to different aeroplanes, they must take another qualification. Sometimes this is not that simple because our habit remains in our mind that we can't simply change from one to the other, explained Shim. With the pilot robot, if we teach individual airplane configuration, then you can fly the aeroplane by simply clicking the aeroplane's type, he added. Part of Pibot's impressive abilities is the integration of large language models, LLM like Chatchbot, into its programming, which lets it read and understand instructions like a human being. We had our predecessor of a pilot robot in 2016. At the time, we didn't have good AI technology, so what we built was a simple robot. They cannot really learn anything from the literature or the manual. But recently, with ChatShapt or with other large language model systems, the technology made paramount progress, Shim explained. Pibot's humanoid form, with a height of 5.24 feet, 160 chem, and a weight of 143.3 pounds, 65 kg, could allow it to take over additional human activities, like as driving automobiles, operating tanks, and guiding ships on the water. The human form may not be the most efficient, but we designed Pivot to be a humanoid form because everything is built for humans. We can have eight arms and four eyes, but we believe that the human form is the best," she added. Pibot is currently in the early stages of development, but it is scheduled to be completed by 2026.